the rest of our lives, in our preaching and our teaching and our writing, to tether the faith of this next generation to the event of the resurrection rather than the authority and the inspiration, the infallibility, or even the inerrancy of the Bible. Where it should have been tethered all along and where the Apostle Peter and the Apostle John tethered theirs. Something dawned on me that I'd never thought about before that has rocked my world and, and changed the way I preach and teach. I made the change almost immediately. It, it dawned on me that Sam Harris shared an assumption with everybody in the room that was a skeptic or an atheist or agnostic, and the, and the assumption that he shared with them, he also shared with most Christians, although most Christians haven't thought about it, and the Christians in the room listening to him and Christians everywhere. Um, and the, uh, it's an assumption that I was raised on, and it's an assumption that most of you were raised on. In fact, when I state this assumption, part of your brain will go, well, that can't be true, and part of you will feel nervous that I'm saying it's not true. And the assumption is simply this, that the Bible is the foundation of the Christian faith.